All right, guys, so it is almost time for winter, and here I have all of my tools that I use to mount my winter tires. The GLC also has the lockable lug nuts, so you can see there's the key ones. So I will need the key for it. These are the plastic dip winter wheels. They're on the Nokian Hakapalita R3 SUV tires. 235, 55, 19 all around. I'm also technically rotating the tires. So when I take these off, I'll show you how I do that. Before you start jacking up the car, make sure you have your parking brake on. So you can see it's on. I like to start off with the lug bolt that has the key and then break this loose. Really easy if you have a breaker bar, but if you don't, you can do it. You would just put this three-way lug wrench and then... <laughs> it's easy, but it takes a lot of force. Make sure you do this so that it'll be a lot easier to take the lug bolts out when the vehicle is lifted. I'm gonna do it to the rear wheels. Got the safe shack here, but since I wanna show you guys how this works, this is the puck I got off of Amazon. Under the car, about right here, you can see this, which is the jacking point. So you would just put this over here and then lift it up using your jack. And now we just jack up the car. The tire is nicely off the ground. I'll take these stands and put them here. Line up the holes, insert it. Same thing for the other side. And then I'll put the pins here. Just like that. Now I'll lower the jack slowly. So we use the jacking points and easily and safely lifted up the car. And right over here, we have enough clearance to remove the tire. And this video is not sponsored. I bought everything you see here myself. I also had to even pay a duty tax when I got this safe jack rent stand, but it's worth it. For the front, I do have my GoPro set up, so you guys can also see a different angle as well while I lift up the front. Line it up. Looks about right, and we jack it up. Now lower it slowly. And just for extra safety, I like to lift the jack underneath. You could even put your tire right about here just for extra protection, but I think for what I'm doing, I should be fine. There's the wheel chocks. Let's remove this wheel. Gotta love the brake dust from Mercedes. While you have your wheels off, it's a great time to inspect and make sure everything seems good. And in our case, this car barely has mileage on it, so everything seems fine. And before I store this old season tire, I'm gonna make sure the tire depth is good. I'm also gonna clean it. These Hakapalita R3 tires are also directional tires, so you can see the rotation. So this is the driver's side. Got my winter bolts. Gonna put a little bit of anti-seize. And that should make it a lot easier to remove these tires after the winter. Line up with the holes. I'm gonna put one of these bolts. Make sure you hand tighten it so that way you don't cross thread them. There we go. Put the one over here. Now I'm gonna take the lug wrench and tighten this up. going to a cross pattern. 
You also want to move the tire around just to make sure everything is good. Here's what it looks like with the front winters mounted. And then we have the all seasons in the back. Let's get that one out. Again, gonna make sure everything's good. Plenty of brake pad left, as you can see. So the rear is mounted, the front is mounted. Now it's time to lower the jack. Put the weight on the jack. Remove the pins. And then slowly lower the front. You can see the tire touch the ground. There we go. Move the jack out of the way, remove the rent stand, and then we will lower the rear. This is the owner's manual on the GLC. Over here, we're gonna tighten these bolts to 111 pound feet. There's 110 and here is 111. Torquing down your wheels is really important, so make sure you have a torque wrench to confirm it. Same thing here for the front. When you're done, don't forget to lower the torque wrench setting. Once I mount these ones, I will also check the tire pressures and make sure everything's where it's supposed to be. And that's about it guys. After about 50 kilometers, I'm gonna be retorquing these wheels just to make sure everything's good. <laughs>